Welcome back to the Everyday Workbench. Here are the questions that you need to ask your painting contractor before they begin painting your kitchen cabinets. Now, there are many painting contractors out there that do really great work on the inside and the outside of a home, but you have to have a special skill set to paint kitchen cabinets successfully. You need the right process, the right product, and the right people to make the project run smoothly and efficiently and to make sure you're achieving a factory finish on the cabinets. You're going to want to make sure they're using a self-leveling paint. If they're not using a self-leveling paint, the finish is not going to look as well as it should. You want to find out if your painting contractor is planning on using a spray method or a roller method to apply the paint. Now, 99% of the time, you're going to want your painting contractor to use a spray method to get the paint on the cabinets. There's kind of a lot involved with spraying your cabinets. Sometimes the contractor may want to bring portions of the cabinets like the doors off site to spray them, or they may want to set up a spray room somewhere on the site like your garage or another room of the house. The appliances will have to get moved. Who's in charge of moving it? Is it the painter that's responsible or is it the homeowner? And if it is the painter, you want to make sure that they have experience in moving appliances around as not to damage them. And more importantly, in the case of a range or a refrigerator, you have active gas lines and water lines involved. The next question you need to ask your painting contractor is, who is protecting the rest of the home? You wanna make sure you're dealing with a painting contractor who has some money in their budget and some strategy on protecting the rest of the home. This may mean uh, floor protection on the way in and out of the kitchen. Uh, this could mean uh, putting up plastic in doorways and making sure that other parts of the home are not being damaged during the process of painting your kitchen cabinets. Now, six months from now, after the painting contractor is gone, you're going to have some wear and tear in the kitchen. Most kitchens have quite a bit of traffic, drawers being used, doors being open and closed. You will need to touch up those cabinets. So it's important to talk to your painting contractor on how to do this because you're not going to have the painting contractor come out to do small minor touch-ups. You as the homeowner should be trained in how to take care of that. How long will this finish last? What happens if the finish begins to chip? And who is responsible if the paint begins to yellow or discolor? These warranty issues need to be discussed before the project begins. These questions were some of the most important questions to ask your painting contractor before your kitchen cabinet painting project begins. Good luck with your project. And as always, thank you for watching the Everyday Workbench.